Now goes it everybody, Spike Daddy here, and this is a quick little video. I've got a uh, mod pack here. Um, so I'll have the link in the description down below, of course. Um, I'm going to kind of walk you through the whole uh, the whole route of doing said stuff here. Um, let's see here. So it's got the following. Now, yes, it does say Donovan and has SMX HUD. So the XM SMX HUD is the UI. So it's a little different than what it used to be, but it still nonetheless does the same thing. Um, it's got Donovan's name on here because, of course, he is the one that put all of these together. Um, most of them, of course, are from... Uh, my previous XMLs that were edited, he just edited it to his stuff, uh, like his better buffs. Um, I know the uh, Beaker, Acid, Jail, and Spikes, those are from me as well. Uh, he did do the better vehicles to make them a little quicker, which is awesome. Better power tools he did as well, which is awesome as well. Um, the Mega Stacks, the more loot bags, um, all these things are good. Oh, I'm going to have to get rid of one of these. Um, we're probably going to drop the Mega Perks. That's what we'll do. We'll get we'll get rid of the mega perks, actually. Um, anyways, once you click on the link here in that, you'll download it. So let me go ahead and just boop, bam, downloaded the dang thing. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna open it up. Let me uh, bring it on over here, like so. So you'll see it here. We're gonna extract all, extract that bad boy, bam, and you'll see it's in here. So you'll see all the stuff that's in here. So. What you want to do is, last time it was just you copied this over and that was it. For this right here, and this one right here is the one that you go through and highlight all of it, or copy it, so right click and do copy unless you do the control C thing, and then you want to go find your 7 days to die directory, which mine is in a different location, yours is probably in the C drive unless you have something different. Then you go into mods, and then you paste all. I'm going to go ahead and do the replace, might as well. Um, the Mega Loot Bags I don't have in there, the All-in-One I don't have in there, and I want to get rid of Mega Perks. So, the Mega Stacks, all that other stuff is inside of here, so now, with all of that being inside of there, now you have to copy it to a Mods folder. Now, if you don't have a folder in here called Mods, that's okay. Literally, just right-click, click on New, Folder, and then call that bad boy Mods. I'm not going to, of course, call it that, because I already have one in there, so I'm going to go ahead and get rid of that real quick. But, yes... So inside of mods, you should have all the stuff inside of here. Inside of those, you should have the configs, which edits the certain things. So with that being all said and done, let me go ahead and exit out of all of that. Um, I should be able to see if I can start up a game real quick here. Let's get into the game here. It should still capture this part, I'm hoping. It looks like that this is the one that it's capturing. So if we just do a continue game, we'll just hop onto here to Navis Gain. It's one that I edited and rendered in earlier. Just to check a look at the UI. So if you do it right, it'll load it all properly. When you get into the game, come on, do your thing. You know you want to. Come on. And bang. Come on. There it goes. Building environment. Haha. -ha. Okay, so yeah, let me wait for this to all go through. Dun -dun -dun. Okay, so there we go. This is the UI. So you'll notice that over in the bottom left you got your health, your stamina, you've got your food, your water, which is good. So you'll have your buff bars over here. Top right is going to be your uh, your craft axe and whatnot. Now the bottom right is actually for the ammo. So that little tiny like darkened spot right there is actually ammo. So if we actually go into, let's do this, go here, and then just do like SMG. Let's just give me SMG real quick. So you see bottom right, that's where the ammo is. So that's why it's kind of darkened out a little bit. Um, top left, of course, is your uh, level, uh, the day plus the time. And that little circle that goes around up there is actually your, uh, here, let me just see if I can move that, there we go, now I can see better, I had to take off the, uh, the FPS counter that I have for the, uh, action software, but this little bar right here, little white ring that goes all the way around, does a full circle, that's your experience, of course, this right here being one, I believe that is just the one, right, day one, yeah, that's what that is, um, it also shows in the top left your feels like temperature, which is the, uh, little, uh, little 
hoodie jacket looking thing on the right. Uh, the middle one, of course, is the outside temperature, and the left one is your elevation. Um, so that takes care of all of that. Um, aside from that, the only thing... I don't think there's anything that's different, really. Um, gather rates, of course, are pretty good, as you see here. Bam, that's pretty good. Let's go over to this tree real quick. We'll smack it around a little. Yeah, 12 per. Yeah, that's a lot better gather rates. And as you can see, the experience bar over on the top left is slowly creeping just ever so slightly just a little bit by a little bit. So, let's see if we can maybe find something that has maybe a little bit more experience. Um, do I have any zombies in the area? I feel like I should have zombies in the area because I've been kind of running around here quite a bit. Oh, hey, let's see how much of this stuff we get. Probably not a lot with this. Well, I guess that's not, not too bad. Not too bad. Um, we might have to uh, edit that. That is a little bit on the lower side. Something that probably hasn't been added yet to it. But it's still not bad. Uh, it's, it's low for sure. I'd like I'd like to get I'd like to get per one of these nodes. I'd like to get probably about three times the amount. Most of the things that I do for XML editing and that is basically just three times the amount of gather rates. That's really all I do. Yeah, you can see this one right here it gets you a lot more. So, looks like we just need to put that in there. I'll talk to uh, Donovan. We'll get that uh, thrown in there. So, hopefully by the time you see this, we'll already have that updated and thrown in there. Um, so, if you click, hit this, boom, four of those. Just like the good old times, you get four of those. Smack that, you get four of those. You get a lot of stone, about 15 per swing. Ah, it's beautiful. So, yeah, that's basically it in a nutshell. Oh, here we go. We've got a, uh, we've got a, we've got an Edgar up here. Edgar, Edgar, dude. Come here, sir. Hi, how are you? You want to get shot in the face? Come on, Edgar. You're holding out on me, bud. There you go. So now you see that big chunk of experience that just went through. That's nice. I like it. Now, of course, there are increased perks in here as well. Uh, so when you level up in that, you get more perks. I don't know what it's set at right now for the more perks. Um, I want to say I think it's like a plus two or plus, plus three. So it's not too crazy, but it's definitely good enough to kind of help you out. Um, hi, buddy. Yeah, nice good chunk right there. It looks like the uh, little bar turns green when it actually gives you a lot of experience. So that's pretty cool to know. So, um, nice little timer for that. You get it, and they do disappear. Now, they disappear, but that doesn't mean that they won't respawn. They actually do respawn after the loot respawns, basically. So that's one of the... Uh, that's one of the things that Donovan created. Makes it to where you don't have to, you know, you don't say, oh, did I already search this? So, it just, it, it makes, it makes it nice. Same thing, it does the same thing with, uh, here, let me see if I can find. Out of my way. What? <gasps> it's a coyote. People telling me it's not a fox. They definitely look like a fucking fox, man. But I guess that is a coyote. It does look like a coyote now. So, anyways. <laughs> Any hoozle. Yeah, we got see the the uh, the experience bar over in the top left here. Moving along all right nicely. Um, where is... I want to find a thing of trash. Because I want to show the trash one. Um, trash, 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 trash. You guys got any trash? You guys don't have shit for trash, do you? Oh, hi, people. Um, I should probably get more bullets. But I'm just I'm just doing this just to show everything. This is just my kind of like my little testing thing. Oh, here we go. Trash. So let me open it. Boom. Disappears. It's great. It's great. So you don't you don't have to double check anything over and over. I was against it at first and then I really tried it out and it was great. Come here, chicken. I'm a horrible shot at chickens. There you go. Ha, ah, got the chicken. Um, if I'm not mistaken, I think some recipes in that have been uh, addressed. Um, so if I go here, recipes, bone knife, only cost one now. Look at that, isn't that nice? That's, that's really nice. Uh, bacon and eggs, if I'm not mistaken in that, still cost two and two, which is the usual. Um, yucca juice. One thing, a bottle of water and one yucca fruit. I do have to uh, get that changed. Uh, it should be an empty jar. Um, that's what it should be, at least. Uh, what else we got? Oh, here's somebody. Oh, it's a piggy. We got a piggy wiggy. You are pissed at me. Ooh, that was the last round, too. Scary. Spoopy.
No, you're not. This is my pig. My bacon. My crispy bacon. So, anyways, guys, I think that's going to do it for this little quick episode here. Once again, just go through and do that. Don't forget, drop a comment. If you have any issues in that, I'll try to help you out, at least in the uh, in the chat there. Um, as far as shout-outs, of course, uh, I do shout-out to uh, the uh, guy who did the UI. Um, now, there is one thing that you would notice, especially for those of you that have actually probably already used the... Uh, uh, the what you call it the UI is in the top left over here. There is actually his initials uh, the SMX is normally up over here. However, I took that out because I thought that was rather I don't know the word for it it was it wasn't really annoying But it was just like I constantly found myself looking up over at it for some reason like it was just like it was up there almost like kind of like a quest sort of thing i just kept i just kept glancing at it and it kept bugging me so i actually took it out of his coding um so that doesn't mean that i'm not going to give credit what credit's due in that so far i love the ui and i am going to go ahead and see if i can get his link in the description down there as well um uh, i'm gonna i'll talk to donovan and see how he wants me to link his stuff down below um but of course guys you know if you haven't already click on that subscribe button Click on that notification bell. That way you can be alerted whenever episode is released. But until next episode, guys, take care and take it easy.